Michael. Come here. Come here, honey. Michael, look. Come get it. Uh oh. Come get it. <laughs> Hence why my ceiling's probably leaking and I'm freaking pissed. So I have to drop him off at daycare and then handle this. And it's Bubakar's first day at his new job, so what I'm not gonna do is involve him and have him worried about the wrong stuff today. I'm having top five worst mornings ever. Yep. Ceiling is leaking. I'm drenched because it's pouring rain out. My Uber that usually cost me about $7 was $19. The CVS associate was rude as hell. And uh, I can't find anyone to help me with my ceiling. So there's that. So this is how I'm living currently. So it's still leaking, but just being observed, I suppose. He came and popped that bubble, but like, yep. Honestly, like, I don't even care. I'm about to just go to sleep, wake up, and try again, you know? Because, it, and I have so much work to do, so I just can't. I just cannot. Look at it. It's bath time. Yeah, reading your book. Huh? Don't worry, I got him. Yay! Yay, baby! Give yourself a shout out. Right now? No. Correct. What? Of course, right now. What kind of food is vlogging. Oh, she's oh, vlogging. Yes. Subscribe to my channel, Lil Nikki, and I think I E. And what do you do on your channel? Nothing, really. Trash, <laughs> trash content. Trash content, but enjoyable trash content. Thank you. This is Jeanette, our manager. Yes, that's me. She's the worst. You're a hater, and wait yeah. until I get your life together. Get it together, then. Okay? I am getting it together. I need you to focus. Oh. Okay? Bye-bye. So, Say goodbye. Okay. Say goodnight. She won't Don't yell. record me. She won't be yelled at. That's what she's going to do. She won't be yelled at. <laughs> Just let me look at it. Just let you look at it. What, your notes? Derek, you have it. Stole it. I can't find Calandra's earring. Cry like him. Cry like him. Oh, oh there it is. Is it a real diamond? <laughs> so let's talk about my day yesterday. You can add a little color commentary because you're good at that. Mm -hmm. So it all started. I awakened from my slumber to a leaky ceiling, which I showed you previously. Ow! Oh, Are you freaking kidding me? Yo, oh, I'm sorry because I was leaning. Yes, oh, and then you catapulted me into the future. What's going on, kids? <laughs> what are we doing, selfies? So my ceiling's leaking. My ceiling's leaking and I'm already overwhelmed. I don't know what to do, so I just pretend it's not happening. <laughs> I start to get Michael ready. We go outside and there's literally a monsoon. Like it is pouring, raining, and windy. I open my umbrella, it snapped in half. Like it just snapped. Like it wasn't like, oh, it's inside out. Like it was broke, like like just clocked out. There's a bunch of broken umbrellas in the street just running around. Yep. So by the time I got to CVS, which is one block, one block, I oh, was monsoon, soaked. Was like it took me so long. My contact got blown out of my eye, okay, you from all the wind. That. Yes, the water was going directly into my eye. I blinked, the contact came out. I was like, okay, guess we're one eye in it. I'm walking down, the wind is blowing, I'm like, with the stroller like michael's cracking up he's like yay he thought it was a great time i get to cvs i'm one-eyed looking for baby food like okay i think that says mango grabbed a whole bunch of those 
I go up to the front and the cashier is leaning and texting. Like this. Exactly. So I'm looking at her and she looking at me. And I'm like, miss. She's like, go down there. With the thumb. With the thumb. I'm looking around. There's no other cashiers. And then I see self-checkout. With one eye. I'm like, self-checkout? She's like, yeah. So, you know, it took all the power invested in me. Because you know I like to spend a coin at CVS, okay? So I would like to be treated like the premium customer that I am, okay? And yes, my receipt was twice my height once again. So I checked myself out, which I should be taking her check. But I checked myself out. Then the Uber comes to take me to the daycare. He don't want to get out the car because it's a monsoon. So I'm trying to get the baby in the car without getting him wet. So he has his plastic cover on. I put him in the back seat. And he, the Uber driver gonna turn around and be like, miss, miss, because he's mad his seat's getting wet. Would you rather my baby get wet, sir? Absolutely so I'm looking not. at him like, sir. And I kept doing what I was doing. If you have a problem with it, get your butt out that car and help me get this baby in here. He just popping trunks, trying to look behind and, and give orders. You better shut up. Finally get to the daycare. I have to go catch the bus home because my Uber costs $19. <laughs> And it usually costs six, so I couldn't afford to Uber back to my house. Is this when you started running? No. Dang. That was in the afternoon. Dang. I ain't even gonna talk about that part yet. <laughs> All I had to say is yesterday was rough, and now my arm's tired. Here go Kelly. You been recording this whole time? She was. I, I am. Camera in my brain's <laughs> Too late. <Yeah>. Smile. <laughs> you don't came the camera. Put this. What did I put? Where are you putting these videos? YouTube. I haven't vlogged today. Hey guys, it's the end of my work day. I have to send one more email. It's a big email though, and then I'm going home. I actually have been working feverishly, so if you could shut your mouth, that'd be great. Okay, thanks. feverishly. Feverishly. F-E-V-E-R-I-S-H-L-Y. Feverishly. Excuse me, it's time to go night night. He said, you could go to bed if you want to, Mom, but I'm busy. Excuse you. How about we sit down? How about we sit down? And how about we tickle attack? Tickle attack. <laughs> you don't want to challenge me. You don't want to challenge me. Yes. You cannot defeat me. Yes. <laughs> we gotta put your PJs on. Oh, oh, he's on the run. I need two hands to do this. Right, baby? Hello. <laughs> Good morning. I'm just getting Michael ready to go to daycare. Let's see what's on the menu. Today we have apple spinach and blueberry and apple mango strawberry. He really likes this one because it has a little more texture. It's for older babies, but my doctor said since he was having a hard time liking baby food, it might be because he likes something with a little more texture. The boy likes to chew. And then milk, lots and lots of milk. So I'm just gonna pack his bag and then get him ready for school. I'm so tired, but I just edited the vlog that I'm going to post tomorrow because I still have to make the thumbnail and do all the other crap, but it's going to go up tomorrow, so I'm proud of myself. Two videos this week. I have no idea what I look like. I don't know if I'm in frame, but I'm going to go to bed now. My stomach is hurting me. <sighs> I'm working from home tomorrow, which is a blessing. I have so much stuff that I have to get done, but I just want to be like lounging in my PJs while doing it. So I will see you guys in the morning. Whew, I'm sweating, but I'm also drinking a hot coffee. So is my camera dirty? I feel like there's something on the lens. So I just dropped off the baby. I'm working from home today. I have a conference call in approximately 25 minutes. So I am going to do some other stuff in the meantime. But yeah, I'm about to upload a video as well. It's all edited, it just needs to go live. I'm so happy, I'm so proud of myself. Tell me y'all, are y'all proud? I'm being a little more consistent. 
I'm dedicating time. If I had to stay up a little later, I had to stay up a little later. But Michael slept through the night, two nights in a row, so there may be hope. Because the issue for me is not the amount of time, it's the interruption. It's the fact that I had to get up in the middle of the night. If I could just sleep for a solid like five and a half hours, I'll be cool. But the getting up after three hours, like that's that's a little too much for me. But yeah, today we're going into the city. We have my little sister-in-law's fashion show, so we're going to see that, bring the baby, have some family time, hugs, kisses, then I'm coming back here and I'm knocking the hell out. Hey, actually, can you do me a quick favor? Would you mind folding that massive load of laundry? Because I actually have three more coming and I need to take a nap and I need to do about six different projects for work. I don't know if this is a Leo thing. See, my birthday's August 19th, so I'm very, very close to a Virgo. So I have Virgo tendencies, but I'm very much a Leo. My moon sign is also a Leo, so like, I'm a Leo for real. I hit you with the moon sign? Y'all didn't know. I be knowing stuff, okay? Someone taught me that at work. You hear that silence? That means another load of laundry is ready for you to fold. Come on over. Come but back to what I was talking about. Since I am a Leo and a Virgo at the same time, I procrastinate and I'm a perfectionist at the same time. As you can see, that's problematic because in order to be a perfectionist, that requires a certain amount of time. But since I'm also procrastinating, I don't give myself that amount of time, which then increases my anxiety and my stress, which we've all known, you know, Shorty got problems with anxiety. Why do I set myself up to be in situations like this? Can you tell me? Any of you guys went to school for psychology? Help me understand myself. You ever have something happen to you, just like, I'm just not going to deal with this right now? Like, this? <laughs> like, why would my coaster do this? Why? But you just, like, put it back and just, like, let someone else think that they did it? That's my MO. <laughs> Boobacar going to be thinking he broke it. I just I am the booba car that I'm super pissed about something and I can't remember what it is and he signed off. <laughs> I hope he doesn't think I'm pissed at him. I mean shoot, I might be, I can't remember. Like I know I'm like super mad about something. And once I remember, they better watch out. 